Candidates participating in Gogonyo County parliamentary by election continue conversing for votes among the electorates. The NRM's party candidate Derek Oron has now entered his second day of the campaign trail. He has spent the entire day engaging voters in Obtet Sub County. However, Oroni's campaign trail continues on the other hand acting as fun factory for the supporters as the candidate enjoys having a backup run from the entertainment industry. <laughs> Besides campaigning, the NRM camp is also carrying on civic education for the voters in this area. Don't think in Oroni's picture that ballot paper will be invalid. Don't think in the bus. We have always lost so many ballot papers counted invalid simply because our people either showed too much love for the candidate and ticked more than once in the, bar in the space provided. Others have ticked uh, in the photograph of the candidate. Others, because they love NRM, they have ticked in the buses. And the presiding officers consider these ballot papers as being invalid. Uh, so what we are trying to do now is to educate our people. We may give them all the messages they want. Yes, we shall. But the most important thing is they must know how to vote. Starting this Saturday, the NRM party machineries will start heading to the district to canvass for votes for their party candidates. But one thing I can guarantee is that the national chairman of the party and the president of this country, General Eric Akutam Seven, will be here on the 9th and is going to campaign for non, not anybody else but Oron Derrick, the flag bearer of NRA. Oron Derrick will continue with his campaign trail this Saturday in the sub-counties of Apopong and Kaukura. They are planting nails along the road, which is not the right thing. This is a democracy. Every candidate is allowed to move from village to village. We have uh, some individuals who are planting these nails and whatever. That's why I'm uh, in the field today talking to them to make sure that we have a peaceful election. We, shall not, we, are, we are not arresting now, but we are engaging them. I'm Robert Nyango for UBC News. Mm -hmm.